I'm going to program the DMX settings on these two light drops with this ARC2 RF remote transmitter. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to hit the home button until we see home on the screen. Next I'm going to hit the minus button to get to the setup menu and then I'm going to hit enter. Now I'm going to hit the minus button until I get to DMX setup. There we are. I'm going to hit the enter button. We are now in the DMX setup menu. And the first thing we need to do is we need to hit this button down here that says target lamps. And we want to make sure that it says target lamps by tapping them and hit enter. Great. We're ready to go. Hit enter to get back into the DMX setup menu. And we see DMX address first. So the light on the left, I'm going to set with DMX address 1. DMX address 1. Hit the plus button. DMX pixels. This is a single pixel light, so we're going to make sure that uh, one pixel is selected. For the DMX table, I'm going to choose RGBS, RGBS. For strobe, I'm going to turn that to off. So in effect, we're just using the RGB channels, so three channels for each fixture. DMX fail, I'm going to leave that to hold. So basically, whatever we previously sent will uh, stay on the light until uh, if there's an interruption with the uh, DMX. And next I'm going to do input select. I'm going to leave that to auto. And that's all the settings. Now normally these lights will be flashing, but we are very close to the lights in proximity with the remote. So I'm going to pull this away. And it's possible that I may even have to hit the send button, which I'm going to do that right now. So it's sending out those programs to the lights. So I'm going to hit the, uh, the on off button once on the left light to accept those settings. So the first one is set and now I'm going to set the second address to DMX address 4 and hit enter. I'll pull my remote away. The lights flash. So now, so now we have the first fixture set to address 1 and the second fixture set to address 4. Thanks for watching.